hello friends in this video i'm going to show you how you can select an image from gallery and show it an image view in android so let's start with the android manifest file and add the permission for read external storage since we are going to read from the disk so let's go to the main activity file and let's uh, create the ui let's go to the layout file and create an image view and with ID image view and a button with ID say uh, button select image let's give a wait for the button since I am in the linear layout and button text as select image let's uh, find that button from the UI and the image view using find view by ID let's clear give a on click listener to the button implement the on click listener and implement the functions now we need to handle the permission you know that if the device is running more than marshmallow we need to ask the runtime permission from the user so if it is running less than marshmallow we don't need to ask the permission so let's check the version and if it is less than marshmallow we are not going to ask the permission if it is greater than marshmallow we are going to check the serve permission for read external storage and if it is not granted we are going to ask the permission so that will be request permission with the context and the list of permissions you want to ask here we are going to ask only the read external storage permission and third one is a constant let's give a constant select image with a value 1000 and let's use that here and let's format it a little bit okay now you can use the handle permission in on create so that it will call when the app launches now is let's use the callback that will be on request permission result and we will just use our indicator that will be the select image and let's loop through the permissions and get the permission let's get the permission as a string string permission equal to permissions of index and if uh, the granted results if it is denied we're going to do something and if it is if the user allows the permission then we are good so if it is else we are good if the user denied the permission we are going to show a rational the rational is going to come it's also an alert same permission dialog but with a never ask again check mark so, so when the user denies the permission we are going to ask it in a rational and if the device if the OS can show the rational if it can show the rational then it is okay we can ask you can have your own soft task for requesting permission again or tell the user to go to settings and manually enable the permission so that means the user has checked the number ask again check mark and he denied the permission completely so the device is not going to show you show the user the runtime permission again so let's show the settings alert at that time let's create the method we will leave it for now and we will go and create the open image user function else we are good and we'll just comment it there and now we will write the image chooser function that will be void image chooser that will open the gallery that will be a new intent and let's add the filter as image so that it will show only the images and the third one is that action as uh, intent dot action default 
sorry, get content. And let's start the activity. Use the start activity for result so that we you can get the data back from the intent. So that will be a new chooser and select image as a title. We will use the same constant as for the callback, select image, and we'll hook it to the button. And we'll let's get the callback. That will be the on activity result. You have to override the on activity result. And let's create a new thread inside the on activity result to process the data coming back. If the result code is OK, and if the request code is our request code, that is select image, you're going to get the data. So that will be final URI, select image URI, equal to data dot get data. And if the select image URI is not equal to null, you're going to set it in the image. So that will be image dot post new runnable. And inside that, we are going to set the image URI, the selected image URI. Let's close that. OK. We'll write the settings alert function. So that will be a new alert dialog. Let's create the builder and create uh, this, sorry, this dot create. Okay, let's set the title as alert and set the message as the app wants needs to access the X storage. You can give any message to for uh, that is convincing to the user. And let's uh, set the button. It's a negative button and give it the on click listener. That will be dialog interface on click listener. Let's uh, add the callbacks. So something wrong. Okay. So the second parameter is the title of the button. Let's give us don't allow. And we'll add another button to redirect them to settings. So that will be a positive button, set button, this was the dialog box when dot dialog is clicked, okay. And the set button, button positive, and title as settings, and the on click listener. And let's dismiss the dialog, and we have to write another method to redirect them to the app settings. Let's create the method. And let's write another intent. So that will be new intent. And let's set the filters, the action. So that will be the settings action. Let's add the category as category default. Next one will be the package, the current apps package. That will be get package name. Sorry, we need to parse that into a URI. Okay, let's add the flags. That will be intent. That will be a new task. Now let's set the add other flags as well. So that will be activity. We don't need any history. We don't need it to show the settings in the uh, app chooser button and let's create clear it from the recents as well let's start the activity okay everything looks good there we don't need the permission I think I did something wrong that should be less than marshmallow then we don't need the permission let's see that okay let's go ahead and run the app now I think everything is good if show rational is show alert so if all are good we don't need to do anything 
go to app settings I think it looks good let's run the app so it will show the runtime permission dialog we will allow the permission let's go to gallery and open the image so everything looks good now let's close the app delete the app and relaunch it again now we are going to deny the permission okay we'll deny let's go back and open the app again it's, it's going to come back with the never ask again rational deny again go back deny and let's use the image so it won't work since we have not given the permission let's go back open the app again now we are going to completely deny so let's uh, okay we'll go back and uh, open the app again it should show the alert but something wrong is there let's check I forgot to use the show method let's run the app again and see if it is coming so there it is we are going to click don't allow okay now we are going to settings here you can see no permission granted let's give the permission for storage and go back let's select the image again this time it should appear okay so that's working if you like the video please subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching